Hey guys. Okay, so in this video, I'm gonna be talking about American slacks, modern American slacks. I've seen some comments requesting this video, this type of video, so I thought it might be fun to just do it. So I hope you enjoy it. First one is on point. On point means something is the ultimate perfection. Something like, you know, oh, your hair is on point. Oh, your outfit is on point. Wow, or, or oh, well, this cooking is on point. Number two is on fleek. On fleek and on point are almost similar, but thing is, on fleek is more kind of a um, when somebody is making a comment on someone's makeup, like, wow, your eyebrow is on fleek. And Lily, your makeup is on fleek, girl. Yeah. FOMO. I don't think FOMO is quite new to 2017 or 2016, but I see this getting thrown around a lot. So FOMO stands for fear of missing out. So FOMO refers to this feeling of um, anxiety when you see pictures of your friends having out at a party or at a wedding that you can't really go to, that you're not there and you feel like you're missing out. But you get this feeling a lot because you are so you're exposed to um, pictures of your friends having fun without you in it. So that is what FOMO means. Savage. Savage means like something is completely badass, you know? It's like your crazy friend who's an adrenaline junkie who does things, you know, who does crazy things and doesn't even give an F about anything. Yeah, you know, we could just dine and dash. That is savage AF. Let's do it. AF stands for S. AF is more of an internet language and you don't really hear it getting thrown around in real life. I don't think I've ever heard anyone saying AF out loud, but that's just me. But it's more common to use on the internet. Um, it's kind of like a metric to how extreme something is. It's cute AF! You're AF! Funny Low key means secretly, so it's like something that you want to keep a secret or like not publicly announced. Hey Josh, I heard you were going to host the party. Yeah, I was thinking of hosting this party at the hotel I'm staying at. It's going to be this huge party, but I, I kind of want to keep it low key, you know? If you could not spread the word too much. Yeah. You know, like you don't want a lot of people to know. Last one is trigger. Triggered means like you are offended by something that you see or is often used when somebody finds something offensive. I see this a lot in the comments of some videos that are controversial like um, this content triggered me. What you said about so and so triggered me. So that is it for this week. I hope you guys like my content and if you do, don't forget to subscribe and share. Until then, I will see you next time. Bye bye.